On Facebook, the Battalion Jagers T.E. Part, Battalion de Chasseurs à Cheval, a cavalry unit of the Belgian Army, announced it has received its first new JLTV, Joint Light Tactical Vehicle, vehicles from Oshkosh Defense. This vehicle is intended to replace the Ibiza Link, LMD, vehicles of the Belgian Army. Quite puzzling at first is the fact that these vehicles are in sand color instead of a more appropriate khaki or green color, considering their assignment to the European Theater of Operations. Will they receive the same removable camouflage stickers as the ones starting to be applied on the French Army's armored vehicles? According to a tweet from DGMR, Directorate General Material Resources, of the Belgian Army dated September 11, 2020, Oshkosh Defense had won the tender to supply 322 JLTV's designated CLV, Command and Liaison Vehicle, for the replacement of the Iveco LMV Lynx armored vehicles in service with the Belgian Army. More precisely, DGMR's tweet announced that the Council of Ministers had given the green light to the Ministry of Defense to buy 322 JLTV CLV command and liaison vehicles. The contract amounting to 134.7 million euros without taking into account the period of 14 days in which competitors excluded from this public market could lodge an appeal with the Council of State. These vehicles would be delivered starting in 2023, three years before the current fleet of Iveco LMVs, like multi-role vehicle, links are withdrawn from service. These CLVs will indeed replace the 437 links currently in service, which will be retired by 2026, when they were built in 2005 and entered service in 2007, data published on the Belgian Defence website. This exceptionally short lifespan for vehicles in the Belgian army is explained by cracks in the chassis and then in the roof armor of 120 SPS and RPK vehicles equipped with an RWS and additional armor, a significant extra weight not foreseen by the manufacturer, 4.855 kg for the basic links, 6.212 kg for the RPK version and up to 6.383 kg for the RPK and SPS versions. The contract with Oshkosh goes hand in hand with another one, worth 15.4 million euros, to provide technical assistance and logistical support to the new CLVs during the first four years after their service entry. 135 of these CLVs will be equipped with an FN Herstal Defender Light RWS armed with a 7.62mm machine gun. The Defense Ministry explained that it had looked for an off the shelf purchase, MOS in jargon to avoid unnecessary development costs, so the program was looking for a mature vehicle that had already been delivered to partner countries. This means that the vehicle has undergone an in-depth lifetime load analysis in a partner country, the United States. Payload, tactical mobility, and passive occupant protection have been taken into account. Said the defense. The CLVs will be integrated with the other vehicles of the motorized capacity, CAMO, program, i.e. 382 VBMR Griffins and 60 EBRC Jaguar reconnaissance and combat armored vehicles, acquired through a partnership with France. The strategic vision for the Belgian defense, 2016-2030, is the guiding thread until 2030 in terms of defense policy, associated investments, the evolution of operations, the defense organization as well as personnel management. It translates the government agreement and was developed by defense specialists, supported by the defense staff and inspired by ideas developed by the parliament and the academic world. The defense strategic vision was released on June 29, 2016 along with the introductory preamble adopted by the government. The document was updated in June 2021.